everyone welcome to today's video today i will show you how to dynamically change the chart titles based on the slicer selection for your understanding i have already created a slicer with market data and then i'm showing a bar graph with top 10 products based on sales if you see here since africa is already selected the title is showing Africa. If I change the selection to Asia Pacific, the title is also changing as per my selection. If I change it to Europe, it is also showing Europe. If I change to USA, it is showing USA. And if I don't select any value, then by default it is showing all markets. Isn't it a very cool feature? Let me show you how to implement this. Let's go to the second page. So first I will use this scenario and I'll show you how to implement that feature and after that I can show you the logic which I have used to implement the first example as well. What I want is based on my year selection the year also should show on the title of this chart and it should change as per my selection. So for that what you have to do is first you have to create a measure. So let's go to the table new measure. Let's keep the name as slicer selection and here we have to use a DAX function called selected value. So if you see selected value so basically whenever you want to pick the value which you are selecting uh, from the slicer you have to use selected value and at a time it can only contain one value. So now let me specify here since my slicer contains year value so I will select year and if there is no value selected then by default I will show all years. That's it. So I have already created this measure and the next step will be to incorporate this measure into this visualization so that we can change the chart title dynamically. How to do that? For that you have to select this then go to visualization and then go to general, go to title. So here you will see this option, conditional formatting. So what you have to do is, you have to select this option. So you have to specify the field value based on which the title should change. So I will, I will select the measure that I have created, that is slicer selection and okay. So see now, right now, since there is no value selected from the year slicer, it is showing all years. If I select 2012, it will show 2012. Based on my selection, as you can see, it is changing. Now, if you want to add some text right before this year, you can do that. Again, let's go to the measure. And here, let's add like total sales by... and add the concatenation operator so that it can combine this text and the year selected. Now hit OK. And see it is showing total sales by and the year that you have selected. So you change the value, the text remains same and the year will change. Now let me go back to the first example and show you the measure that I have created to implement this. Again the logic is uh, very similar. Instead of year, I have used selected value and market and by default, I am showing all markets. So, well, that's all for today's video. I hope you have liked this video. Thanks a lot for watching. Do subscribe to my channel. Bye-bye.